And here I give an example of uh, electric uh, vehicle charging points. Uh, electric vehicles are already here in the world and uh, very soon they will be coming to this country in a big number and uh, we expect uh, some of the retail stations for example will have charging points for these uh, electric EVs. So we have left it open such that uh, in case a new concept comes out we don't have to revise the law. We just adopt the framework that has been provided. So it is a requirement for you to obtain a license to operate or an approval from the authority to operate this common user facility. And of course there are fines and penalties if you operate a facility as common user without the authorization of the uh, uh, EPRA or the licensing authority. Uh, so there are requirements for that license application. I will not go through them. It's al almost similar to what Ezra was talking about in retail stations. But the requirements, the framework is the same. The requirements may be different, but they are in the schedule. You will look at them. Uh, renew of license. So here uh, we expect that 30 days before expi expiry of your license, you will be able to apply for a renew of the license. And I think the period for licensing, we have to insist we only consider materially complete documents. Once you send us documents that, uh, an application that doesn't have particular documents, uh, that application is returned to you requesting for more information. So whenever you find that uh, your licensing license is taking too long, uh, maybe it's because the first time you applied, you did not attach a tax compliance. So normally what we do, our system automatically uh, returns the application to you and sends you an email to alert you.